Like it was all mad because I must have got the knife here and then I stabbed him in his back but that was nothing. Why would I sell a bowl of bananas for a pound? Well, I can just go inside and get a loan of somebody else's name. It made 10 grand in a day. You know how I do, I spit about what I've been through. Put a bullet in you, rub you, then bin you. Talk to some horrible stuff. Ooh, I was a menace. Um, that smell. Mm. What's that worth now? About 70 grand each. It's 140 grand. And if someone nicked that, what, what would you do? If I caught them? Yes. Undocumented weapons appeal to street gangs more than any other firearm. Things like this, cut that there, cut that there, nothing goes, we track it, no problem. How do you find having to <laughs> collect more medication and obviously that being currently illegal in this country? I need to go out and I need to get this marijuana, but I should imagine there's an awful lot of parents, um, brothers, uncles, etc. that are having to do exactly the same thing as me. So, the advice to anyone is this. If you do go into a shop and your card does get trapped in one of these slots, don't call the numbers that are on the stickers. Loads of people have come out today. You can see behind me, we are still marching in full effect right down to Hackney. <laughs> she is lovely. We'd love to spend loads more time with her. Well, you She's can. adorable. OK. But you can just put that on your bill. Yeah, fine. But how have you been, anyway? I've been good. I've been very good. Yeah, I was Millwall's first black football fan. We went to Sunderland and all the fans were shouting, Zika, 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 Millwall's got the and making our uh, not Nazi salutes. How did that make you feel? Well, everybody reacts different. I loved it. Do you understand the attention? It was good. Looking back at it now, get me, I can see that he was trying to be strong. You get what I'm saying? Like, and that's the match. Again, HMP Featherstone yeah. to deliver a talk to the inmates. I can relate as an ex offender myself. It's not easy to get through prison. It's not easy to go and sit on a visit and see your family. It's not easy to get bad news on the phone. So you can't tell me all I am is some criminal because what I've just got through was a real ordeal. A detective said that there are more armed robbers per square foot in Bermondsey than anywhere else in the country. Oh no, because I was one of them. <laughs> <laughs>